We are headed to do some Christmas shopping. We are starting at Kirkland's and they had such a beautiful Christmas decor selection this year. They had nativity centers, these gorgeous tree collars, so many different ornaments, some really unique pieces that I haven't seen at other stores. If you are doing the traditional colors, this Christmas tree is so fun. I loved it so much. They went all out on that Christmas tree and I love the way the green and red pillows look with the tree. They had so many nutcrackers. I like to stay more for the neutral one, so I didn't pick one up, but I love this little cabinet. They had chargers if you're doing a tablescape. And then I absolutely loved these wood cutting boards. It came in a little Christmas tree, which is is so cute and also a little bell. This is Kirkland's take on the $70 candy cane pillow from Pottery Barn. They had some really cute options and then they had a whole table dedicated to nutcracker items, which was so cute. I love the glasses and mugs and those little candlesticks are adorable. And then they had some really cute kitchen items over here. And now we are in Marshall's. So Marshall's did not disappoint either. They were fully packed of Christmas decor. So many beautiful pieces like those lights life-size reindeers and nutcrackers. How cute is that snowman mug? I always love looking at the seasonal mugs. It's such a fun way to get in the Christmas spirit by replacing your mugs with just a fun Christmas one. So definitely check out Marshall's if you're into that. And they had some really beautiful glasses if you're doing a tablescape. And how cute is that little plate to put like fresh baked cookies on and these little gingerbread measuring cups were so cute. I love this sign, Jesus is the reason for the season. Let's not forget, and look at these bells, you guys. They are candles. I actually own the bells, but mine are not candles. These were $16.99, and the candle actually smelled amazing. And when you're done burning the candle, you have a super cute decor item, which is so fun. They had so many different reindeers and unique Christmas trees. Okay, so I wanna share with you all everything that I picked up from this shopping trip. So we popped into Kirkland's, Marshall's, and then you guys, I had to pop back into Home Goods because I shared in my last video that I'm trying to hunt down some items. And then yesterday we put up our Christmas tree. I'm so excited to get it decorated. I had my husband bring in all of the Christmas crates as well as the tree, and we decided to put it up, and I'm so glad we did. So in my next video, we're gonna be getting all of my Christmas decor decorated around my home. We're gonna be decorating the tree. I can't wait for that. But I wanna share with you guys all the things I picked up. First up, I picked up these branches. These came from Marshalls, and they were $12.99. I love these branches. I have so many vases around my home and I love changing out the stems for the new season. So we made some fall arrangements and I also wanted to make a little Christmas arrangement. So I thought these were perfect. This is by the Martha Stewart line. I told you guys in my last video, Martha Stewart is killing it. Her holiday decor is so, so beautiful. So I picked up three of these stems and hopefully that'll be enough. I usually would pick up like four, but they only had three. So I'm hoping this will still fill the vase nicely. I told you all in my home goods video, if you missed it, go check it out. I take you to home goods, share all of the Christmas decor in store right now. But I shared that I was looking for the viral gingerbread man from Pottery Barn. Home goods had a dupe for like a fraction of the price. The Pottery Barn one is like $70 and then Home Goods had one, I believe for $16.99. I didn't find the single one, but I did find the family. <laughs> so 
I was hunting everywhere for this gingerbread man and I sent the picture to my mom. I said, if you go to Home Goods and you see it, you have to pick it up. So she went to Home Goods and found it. She couldn't find the singular one, but she did find the family and it is so, so cute, you guys. So it's a pack of three. You have the baby, you also have the mom and the dad. Can you see like the faces of the gingerbread? This is the one that I really wanted and you get the whole pack for $34.99. I don't know where I'm gonna put them, but I know for sure one's gonna go in my office since I'm doing like a gingerbread theme in my office this year. Last year I added a couple of gingerbread men to my tree and I wanted to add some more this year. So I think this pillow is just gonna be so, so cute in my office chair. Going with the gingerbread theme, I had to pick up this candy cane pillow. Again, this is at Pottery Barn. I got it at Home Goods for $19.99. It is so big and it's soft. It's a little candy cane pillow. How cute is that? I couldn't get the gingerbread men without getting the candy cane. So I'm gonna find somewhere to put it in my office. The next item goes with the gingerbread theme as well. And it is the gingerbread house. And I was hunting down this one, actually the smaller version of this one. I didn't even know they made the large one, but we found this at Marshall's for $24.99. And I think it's just so, so cute. It's gonna go so well with the candy cane and the gingerbread man. It's just so, so fun. I can't wait to decorate with these pillows. I also had to pick up these little hand towels and they have little embroidered gingerbread men on them. They are so adorable. I'm gonna put these in the bathroom and they were $12.99, which I thought was a really good price. And I almost forgot to share with you guys the last gingerbread item I got from Kirkland's. And I saw this and had to have it. It is a ceramic platter and it's huge. I don't know if you guys can tell. Um, it was $19.99 and I think it's the most perfect little platter to put like fresh baked cookies on. You can do a pancake platter, a little waffle platter. It is just the most adorable little plate ever. I got another Christmas blanket and I didn't need another one, but I couldn't pass this one up. It is the same blanket that I shared in my last video. Do you guys remember that brown and cream checkered um, blanket? I found it in green for the Christmas season. They also had it in red as well. And it's just so beautiful. I wish the checkered was green and beige, but it's like a green and white. And I love that it's a throw and a blanket. It's super super soft it was $24.99 so depending on if you want the green one the red one and I actually saw a couple of other colors as well depending on what you're decorating with this year we'll determine what color you may want to get but this is just such a beautiful blanket and it is 50 by 70 so that's a really big size I was between the green and the red one since I already have so much green but I just love the green one you guys it is so beautiful. This next item, I saw these pillows and got so excited. I love anything boucle. I have a boucle chair in my office and I have a boucle little bench in my master bedroom. I just think it's such a beautiful fabric. So I saw these massive boucle pillows at Home Goods and these pillows were $34.99. They are 24 by 24, so they're a really big size and they feel like really good quality. And I love when you can find pillows at Home Goods that have that down filled cushion in the inside. You can karate chop the pillow and it just looks so high end and expensive. I love that this has a removable cover as well. It just feels super soft. It feels like amazing quality. And I'm probably going to decorate with it either on the couch or the master bed, but I got two of them and I can't believe I found them at Home Goods. That is everything that we picked up from the shopping trip. I think I'm officially done shopping for Christmas decor. And in my next video, we're definitely gonna be getting my tree decorated and getting all of this new decor decorated around my home with the existing decor we have. So make sure you stay tuned for my decorating video. I am now making one of my favorite recipes that I make every fall season, and that is my tortellini soup. I've shared with you guys the Instant Pot version, but I've never shared the stovetop version, so it is so easy to make. You just start by adding some olive oil to a pan, sauteing some onions, and then you add your Italian sausage, and you add some garlic, let that cook, and then all of the ingredients that I add to the soup, I will leave down below, but I added some chicken stock, 
some diced tomatoes. I also added in some coconut cream instead of heavy whipping cream, which tasted the exact same by the way, but so much healthier for you. And all of the spices, as always, I will have the recipe typed down below for you guys. I just let that come to a boil before adding in our tortellini. And then I just cooked the soup until the tortellini was fully cooked through, which took about seven more minutes and it was done and so, so good. And I wanted to let you guys know this caraway pot that I'm using is currently on sale as well as the Squareware set that I shared a couple of weeks ago on my YouTube channel. Caraway is having their holiday sale, so their site is up to 20% off. So if you've been eyeing my beautiful pot and pan set or this Squareware set, now is the time to get it. I will leave my discount link down below and the sale is for a limited time. So definitely check it out. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I would love it if you hit that subscribe button and join the family here on my YouTube channel. And I will be seeing you all very soon with a brand new video. Bye.